yes, YouTube. Um, still in in Brooklyn. Just witnessed an accident. Who is that? I, it's not me. It's that guy. Yes, um, I just witnessed an accident. Um, I don't know whose fault it is. It is. Well, I would think maybe it would be the female driver. The truck went wide. For more videos like this, please subscribe. Yeah, you too. Christ our second in, in, in Brooklyn, New York, Brooklyn, New York. And um, basically, this car was trying to turn along with the truck. This truck is not, um, as far as I'm seeing, maybe like a, a 40 feet flatbed. Um, he went wide because it's a one way street. Um, the street is called uh, in Dale, it's a one-way street. You can see the sign. It's a one-way, and um, he went wide to make the turn, and the car turned along with the truck. You know what I mean? So I, I saw it right there. So I had a spark. You know what I mean? And and it was all the way up here to the stoplight. So this is it. We can go ahead and say the truck, the truck, the truck driver. I don't know who, who is getting the wrong way right here. I can't tell you, right? Because I'm not sure what's going on. But one thing for sure, I was taught to block the road with the truck. When, when you're making a, a blind turn, you have to block. You, you have to do a block. Like, a, um, maybe I'll do a video on one of that and show you guys. You have to do a block. Um, mainly, you'd have to come straight. You'd have to come straight down. And when you reach all the way, close enough maybe like 10 feet away to stop you swing right then swing left and then position yourself to turn so that means the trailer will block the street so there's no one to to squeeze it on the the blind side to, to come at the edge like what happened right here when you block the road with the truck that's what you do you prevent anyone from coming to the side right so basically when you when you block that this wouldn't happen if if he had um blocked before he made the turn but then again like i said i don't know who wrong or whatever i'm just that's a that's a side viewer yes youtube try stars and if you pay close attention here you can see that there's no vehicle passing on the right side because the back of the trailer is in the right lane but the cab is in the left lane and I'm positioned to turn right. So as you can see, um, clearly in halfway, not in the middle of the street, but halfway, the light is on red now. But as soon as, as the light turn, turns green, I'm going to remain in my same position because I want to ensure that the lane that I'm turning in is extremely like like empty. Um there are cars parked if you can look close they can see that there's a car park over on the far um uh left on the street that i'm turning right on and there's also a car park at the same position 
on the on the right so now that i'm turning here as you can see I, I go all the way all the way as close as possible to the car over on the, the left and i stayed in that left lane all the way until my trailer clear the car on the edge of the road and then i will just go over in my lane which would be on the right side um that is just a perfect example of blocking you know make a block before you make a turn um in this one is the same um basically i stayed in the right lane and as soon as my turn is coming up i swing over in the left and then i go all the way down in the middle of the street and then i made the turn normally i would stop the video right here and explain something to you guys which this is it when you make a turn like this and you see that the car is over the the line the marker line that is already marked there just for trucks or for anyone doing a wide turn if you see a vehicle over that lane all you need to do is just stop wait that person will either move his car or you wait until the light change just don't move don't try to back up or anything because if you back up in someone you're going to be wrong you know what i mean if he come across on those white line that you see and if he park wrong that mean he's already in the wrong so all you need to do is just wait and let the, the the lane clear and then you can go there's nothing wrong with waiting you will get a lot of people honking you blowing their on cussing but listen just be focused pay attention to the road and don't let anything distract you because by the end of the day you are the one that is going to get penalty on your license points losing and also losing a credibility and if you're running your own authority cvo or all that you will be in trouble when you cause an accident and worse insurance that's another story you don't want none of those things to be on your license especially in the u.s now this is in the bronx and trust me in the bronx is very tight very close and if you know how to make those tight turns you will get in free and get out free now i hope this video helps someone or i hope this video is uh, you know a good advice to maybe someone that don't know because there are a lot of guys that know but there's also a lot that didn't know because you know they didn't think it was right to do some of those um blocks just to ensure or keep themselves covered from upcoming or incoming traffic you know what i mean but it's try stars i mean if you're new to my channel please subscribe and once again thanks for tuning in and big up respect and thanks for watching try stars peace for more videos like this please subscribe